We look at things like a pandemic and we're like, why do bad things happen? You know what, honestly, half the time when we look at the cosmology of the ancient world, the better question is, why do good things happen? And you know why they do. Because the God at the center of the cosmos is good, is love. He's the definition of love itself. So if you're ever wondering why good things happen, it's because sometimes the people who are made in his image actually image him to the rest of the world. What is it in this pandemic that has just felt too strong on your life to get through? You have the God sitting on the throne reigning over you. It's big, I get it. But it's not so big that he can't handle it. So as we come and we take communion, as you do it, ask the lamb how you can image him better, how you can show the world more clearly what he looks like, how you can be self-sacrificial love to others. Because as it ends up, the God of the cosmos who would never need to come down here, he did it. The God of the cosmos who could choose to not love us if he wanted, he would never have it that way because he is love. And he gives love. And this body that's been broken for you, and this blood that's been poured out for you, this is an extension of his love to you today.